that uh, uh, I want to do the most that I can to make make the live stream better for them. Because uh, it's kind of like for the viewers. But also, um, um, I would say that also your, your subject material is like super important. And always try to show utmost respect for people that you're covering. Um, that just pretty much goes without saying. Um, yeah. I was just gonna, I'm just going to jump in here because tying in the subject matter and then some of the stuff. Also, interactivity with our audience. Uh, Rice PDX mentions that the future of blogs is Rebel Mouse, which is funny because we were talking, yeah, about we were talking about that Rebel earlier. Mouse earlier yeah, and account, the importance yeah. of social networking and being on the edge of the new stuff. So, yeah. Um, yeah, so he says that. And then also, just in terms of what you're saying, you know, you have to really. Um, Again, with the social networking, be on top of that stuff and be able to connect with people through the digital inter you know interface and and make a connection that lasts, you know, because these people will, you know. Another thing about social networking is it can save your life. I mean, when yeah. you're covering an event, make sure that you either ask people that are organizing the event uh, or come up with a hashtag of your own. Does everybody know what a hashtag is? Okay, hashtag on Twitter is the, uh, the tic tac toe <coughs> symbol. Pound symbol. symbol. Pound right, just note that before a term that you're using. And if it's two more than one word, make sure you cap up both the words together. Right? Like uh, like for this uh, particular uh, event, I, I either call it, I put a hashtag live stream or a hashtag OCAM. Um, if you're live streaming, use that OCAM. Um, that's a universally recognized tag for live streamers that we came up with uh, during Occupy. And, uh, and this will notify what a, what a hashtag allows people to do is to do searches on Twitter for something they might be interested in. And always keep your hashtags to the point as short as possible. Because a lot of people on Twitter are getting through their SMS, right, their message, right? I get all my tweets through my, uh, when I'm not on the computer, I usually get them through my texts. So, uh, and as everybody knows, texting on a smartphone or any other phone is a pain in the ass. Hmm. Um, I mean, it's not that hard, but it is kind of a pain in the butt. So the shorter the uh, term, the better you'll, better off you'll be. And that goes the same for things like anything, like URLs, your Ustream account, all that kind of stuff. And your Ustream account can be linked so that you can actually get your Twitter, your direct... <laughs> right, so Twitter, you can send a message to somebody through Twitter while they're live streaming, and they'll get it. Right. Yeah, Facebook doesn't offer that yet. You're behind Facebook. Uh, well, what time is it right now? Anyway? About three thirty. We got a clock over there. Yeah, I like use a break. Myself. Yeah, because um, we've been here for about that hour, fifteen, twenty minutes. It's a pretty interesting subject, though. Um, for those of you that are live streaming uh, are watching the live stream, I'm going to take a short break, uh, about ten minutes, and we'll be right back. Thanks a lot for watching.